Hey, I'm Matt Redman with Mackie here at Full Compass to talk about our Axis digital mixing system. Now the Axis is comprised of a couple different parts. The DL32R digital mixing system, that's where our 32 ins and 14 analog outs are. That's got our Dante option card connected to it, which in turn connects us to the DC16 control surface. You can see featured here with our 26 full color screens, 16 plus 100 millimeter touch sensitive motorized Alps faders, and then of course the three iPads which will be sold separately sitting here in our smart bridge. Now I want to focus on three key areas for us that we focused on in the development of this product. One of them is that it's fast and easy to use. Two is that it's completely customizable, which means you can set it up to be as complex or as simple as you need, which in turn plays into that speed of mixing and ease of use. And third, is that it was designed for multitasking. So to my first point, the speed of mix, right? I can very easily select any channel on the mixer, which is easy to tell where I'm at because of these clear full color displays, and immediately start adjusting parameters like equalization, uh, compression threshold, ratio, and you can see the iPad following along as I make those changes, and I can very easily jump in and switch between using the, the touch screen of the iPad or, of course, the hardware controls of the DC-16. So as you can see, it's very easy to, to see where you're at on the mixer, to navigate around, and to very quickly address any of the core mix parameters that you might need to. There's plenty more ways to do that, of course, but that's just a couple. Second to that is some of the customization that we can get into. Again, referencing these screens that we have here, you can see our icon library full of the primary instruments that you would use, kick drums, snares, uh, guitars, etc. You can even take pictures if you want of yourself and those will populate right onto the control surface as well. So again, easy to customize so you can always tell where you're at and navigate around the mixer very easily. In addition to the customization that you can do on the full color screens on top of the channel strips here, we've got a few more on both sides of the mixer that we'll get into next. One of those is the view groups. Now the view groups allow me to look at any subset of channels on the mixer as opposed to the entire mix, right? So if I'm viewing all of my channels, I can bank around the mixer as you would on any traditional mixing surface. But if I want to make a custom view group comprised of just my drums or just the vocal channel or as many or as few channels as I need in a view group, I can very easily add or subtract channels from those view groups. And again, I've got six different custom view groups for whatever I need. So those six custom view groups, again, allow me to configure the mixer to be as complex or as simple as I need it to be, which makes it very easy for me to navigate around on the mixer to wherever I need to be, all with one touch. So the view groups allow us to look at all of our different inputs and channels on the mixer, while over on the right of the mixer, we've got our mix selector, which allows us to look at the different outputs. For example, right now we're looking at our main mix. If I want to bring up auxiliary one on faders, I can do that, auxiliary four, etc., and back to the mains. Or if I want to look at all of my outputs, I simply hit the masters button and I've got all my auxiliary outputs or all of my matrix outputs on faders. And I can simply hit that masters button and go right back to the view of the mixer that I was on before. So that level of customization and speed of navigation allows you to do a lot very, very quickly and really brings the fun back into the mix. The final point that I want to go over is that this mixer was designed for multitasking. One of the things that I'll show to illustrate that are these three iPads here at the top. Now again, we saw the first iPad uh, in the middle here following along as I was making adjustments to the mix. I have this iPad set up to always follow what I'm doing. This second iPad, I actually have set up as a first history. So if I select a different channel on the mixer, what we'll see is the EQ curve in the middle will move over to the mixer on the left. Very handy because now I can mix two things at the same time between the center iPad and the one on the left. The right iPad, meanwhile, I can configure to be in a fixed mode. So it's always showing me, uh, for example, my overview screen. So you can configure these iPads, each of them know where they're at, each of them knows what their job is, uh, and you can customize that to, to, to your setting as well. So in addition to each iPad knowing where it is on the mixer and having its assigned job, of course the ability to go wireless is a huge benefit of this system as well. For example, I can pick up an iPad and go over and mix a monitor at the monitor, of course, the best place to do that. And I can ring it out, draw my EQ curve, and I'm very happy with that mix. I'll walk back over to the mixer, drop the iPad in, and as you can see, it goes right back 
to the screen that I had it on when I was at the desk. So very easy for the workflow and allows me to multitask in a bunch of different ways. The final multitasking point that I'll bring up today is recording. We offer four different ways to record. Direct to drive, our USB drive that's playing our session back today. To a computer, of course, Mac or PC, to your favorite DAW. Uh, using the Dante virtual sound card, we can record to any Dante uh, device on the network as well. And finally, stereo recording and playback to and from the center iPad over the control port. Because of its flexibility and ease of use, the Axis Digital Mixing System is ideal for loads of different applications. Everything from house of worship to clubs, theater installs, and many more. Now there's a lot more to talk about with the Axis Digital Mixing System, of course. So to learn more about the system, go to fullcompass.com or contact your Full Compass sales pro.